Hello guys and welcome back to our channel of Handy Games. My name is Jan, I'm a tester here at our company, as you might know already. And today we have a new and special video for you. It's our very first Townsman FAQ video. So you ask us a lot of questions on Facebook, Twitter, Google+, and all other social channels that there are available. And yeah, today we are going to answer some of these. Good! So then, let us begin with the very first question. It's from Hauke. He wrote us on Facebook and he wanted to know, among a lot of other things, what has inspired us to develop a mobile game like Townsman? And yeah, that's an easy question to answer, as many of you guys have already been inspired by the early strategy titles like Settlers or Anno. We were also always thrilled to play them and we liked the atmosphere and the gameplay design and the beautiful details these games incorporated. So we wanted to develop a mobile game that holds up to these values, but it was very important for us to realize our own ideas and this is how Townsman got developed. And speaking of enthusiasm for simulation and strategy games, another question from Hauke would be do you play your own games? And yes, of course we play our own games, we like our games, and if we didn't like our games, we wouldn't play our own games. Um, it would be something different if we would develop a typical diamond swap game or whatever, but it was always, or we strived, we always strive to develop games we like to play in our own spare time. So yes, we like to play our own games and we play our own games. And this is especially true for Townsman, since a lot of players, like millions of players, play uh, Townsman. Actually, it's like 10 million players, so that's one, two, seven zeros. A big number, 10 million players play Townsman, and yeah, what can we say? Thanks a lot, guys. We really like um, that you like our game. <laughs> And um, you can get quite dizzy with these large numbers and yes, uh, what else is there to say? Thanks a lot for playing Townsman and um, well, let's continue with another question. You ask us where the players playing Townsman come from uh, or especially which countries. So we have the top three countries where our Townsman players come from. And it's the third place goes to Russia with more than 3 million player sessions only in the last year. Second place closely followed by China with 4 million players or player sessions. And the first place goes to insert fancy sound effect here. Indonesia! 8 million players from Indonesia like to dive down in the medieval world of Townsman and enjoy our wonderful game. Good! After so many general questions about Townsman, let's continue with a question from Jilom. Are you one day planning to make a port on PC? Uh, well, we are specialized in mobile games, so what are you expecting from us? I mean, <laughs> yeah, no, jokes aside, um, yes, we already released some games on Windows 8 and Steam, like for example our Devils and Demons RPG, you can download that on Steam, do it now, do it now, do it now, thanks, awesome, yes. And um, yeah, so we didn't rule out the possibility, but I'm not inclined to say anything about that. So I'm sorry and I can leave you only with a maybe. And another question regarding this topic would be, do you have more stuff for feature up feature, sorry, for future updates? Um, and with that, it's the same as with the PC. I uh, can't really say anything about that, but of course we have a ton of ideas, a ton of features on our bucket list. And uh, yeah, but currently we are more focused on bug fixing and overall optimizations for a smoother gameplay experience. So sorry, I can't tell you anything more about that. But nevertheless, we are always happy to read any feedback from you guys or any ideas. So if you have some fancy gameplay ideas, don't hesitate to shoot us a message on Facebook, Google+, Twitter or an email, whatever. We really like your feedback and enjoy reading all of it. And let's continue with another question. It's from Zarnas. 
Can we expect some updates to the combat part of the game, such as various troops and different weapons and armor? Well, we will add that to our bucket list, but unfortunately I cannot promise anything at this time. And the next question is from Aditya, also from Facebook. Will you someday update Nighttime? Well, it's fairly hard to update Nighttime, but I mean, do we want to implement a day and night cycle? And well, along the development of Townsman, we talked about a day and night cycle, but after some internal testing, we decided against this feature since it would mean a lot of balancing changes and artbook changes. And overall, we decided then against that and we have gone with the season changes. But we might come up with um, a day and night cycle in some future iterations of Townsman. So let's see, maybe there's something in the future for the Townsman and the day and night cycle. Good. Last but not least, the last question I'm going to answer is from Stefan, Stephen, Stephen, Stefan, Stefan, whatever, from Twitter. Any chance it could come to console? As I have said already, I can't really say too much at this point, but we have not ruled out the possibility to bring Townsman to consoles, but uh, yeah, you, it might prove difficult to realize the controls with a gamepad. So yeah, let's, let's say maybe, <laughs> sorry. <laughs> So, I was not able to answer all of your questions, uh, but I hope you enjoyed our first FAQ video for Townsman. And if you like more videos, I would say subscribe and like our YouTube channel or go to our Facebook page, ask us some questions. We always enjoy reading your feedback. And as always, have a nice day and I will see you guys next time.